All right, guys. We are doing a little bit of a garden family affair here. Trying to look at our crops and what we've got going. We've kind of lost control of the tomatoes for sure. The zucchinis, we've been doing great. There's a nice one right here. We can harvest. And I wanted to show you guys, so down low, you're gonna see these. So these are the female flowers. They come off the main stem and you'll see the um, zucchini starting to grow off of them. These ones sticking up in the middle, those are actually the male flowers that stick straight up. Um, and after they're older, you can see they um, fall off and more grow. Um, they are edible. Uh, we've actually got some people that like them. And um, just some information on the difference between the male and the female flowers. Look at that zucchini. Or summer squash, I always call them zucchinis to me. They all taste the same. Everything's looking good. There's a big one that's escaped us a little bit here. I was actually out tuna fishing this weekend, so I, well not this weekend, Thursday, so I wasn't able to do my normal garden duties. But I figured I'd bring you guys along for a harvest. Try not to cut anything other than what we're grabbing. And again, this YouTube channel is going to be about sharing our tips on how to be profitable farming on a nice small urban farm and the tips and tricks and for anyone that just plain wants to enjoy watching our farm <clears throat> everything's always changing here so every day you never know there's some cucumbers I'm hoping we don't have too many big ones because we've got to spend a few days and things grow fast here. Our soil, we're very lucky, is great. And we're very happy for that. Our um, secret in the garden is rabbit manure from our own bunnies and it's something that we um, try to use every part of our homestead and that's the key in an urban garden urban farm is everything has to have a reason you only have so much space so you have to use every bit of space now the Peppers in there. What are you doing, Hunter Danta? Hi. Can't wait for this guy to be old enough to come out here and pick them for me. So our carrots are getting a little overgrown with grass, but they're getting pretty big. Onions, we have a few that are starting to tip over. Spinach, we've lost control. We have plenty of spinach. These are potatoes. Can't wait to dig those up. That's gonna be fun, taking Hunter for the ride. And we got lots of green tomatoes. We're actually, uh, red tomatoes. We're actually a little slow on tomatoes this year. So it's a welcome sight. We've got a lot of people asking for them. So we're looking forward to that. But that's the garden update. Everything's looking pretty good. Again, if you guys could like and Share this video, subscribe. That'd be wonderful. Again, we're trying to grow this channel and reach as many people as we can that are interested in our lifestyle and how we do things. 
We have a little over two acres here, but we're just south of Boston, as you can probably tell with our Boston accent. <laughs> 